How's it going, everyone? I'm Nostalgia Dave, and welcome back to more than Nostalgia Train. Okay, so I know technically we don't have the Hylian Shield. Some that might that might mean we're not at 100% on this yet, but you know what? I'm not getting it. In my opinion, it's not worth the effort. Because it randomly chooses bosses, and some of the bosses in this game are just BS. So, we're going to pretend like we've 100%ed it, including that, and move on. But that's also why, to me, 100%ing means getting all the bottles and the heart pieces. That's it. And since I've done both of those, I'll also heart pieces include, like, this and this as well. So, yeah, we're good to go. Let's go and finish this. Once and for all. You want to move on and get into demon's blood. All right, where is he? Hey, Impa. Oh boy. <laughs> Ugh, hey, it's Garahim. He appeared out of thin air and got the drop on me. <sighs> Don't worry about me. We must chase after him. He ran through the great doors at the front of the temple. You may yet catch him before it's too late. Hurry. Okay. And as you noticed as well, I did go ahead and fill up my bottles with berries, because trust me, it's needed. Especially for what's about to happen. Ah, oh, crap. Oh, boy. The sound effects in this have a tendency to be a bit louder for some reason. What are you doing, Giraham? Now is not, to, not the time to be doing the Harlem Shake. <laughs> hey, don't look at me like that. Okay. Alright, this is, uh, kind of bogus. Help you S on this. Don't be on this. This is causing an itch in my nose and I don't appreciate it. Hear me, my horse. The spell is nearly complete. The Demon King returns. Until then, you will keep that wealth from interfering with my ritual. Oh, yeah, really? Oh, crap. I don't care if the whole lot of you get lodged on the end of his blade. You will buy me the time I need. All right. Oops. Oh, duh. There is something I forgot to do. I pause. I forgot to do this in the mindset of I need to get so many of these done simultaneously. If you guys saw yesterday's vlog, you know exactly what I mean. Here, let me fix it. Delay it again. Who cares at this point? <sighs> All right. Ta -da. Luckily, this isn't a time-limited thing. It's just a case of... I mean, bro. Oh my gosh. Hordes and hordes of the same one enemy. Side of what's technically the final boss. Once we go past that area, we are committing to finishing the game. That being said, let's do it. We got five. 
five bottles, all of berries in them, and we're pretty much full on health. However, this guy, I was never able to figure out directly how to approach him. Really? You're gonna throw this at me. Hey, man, come on. I mean, thank you for the three hearts, <laughs> but <laughs> Bam. I'm not going down without a fight, bruh. Far too quick, boy. I know. I realize a simple child like you knows nothing of magic, but spells like this take time in the steady hand. Can't you wait quietly like a good boy? Hmm? Nah. <laughs> you petulant brat! You pushed me too far. I've waited my whole existence for this. This is my moment! You know what? Fine. If you're so intent on hurrying to your grave, I'll be happy to show you the way out. Goody. This time, there will be no heroic escape. I was a fool to toy with you and let you walk away with your life before. But I won't make the same mistake again. Alright. You know what? Fine. You want to fight? Come at me. Oh, this is not going to end well for me, is it? That I promise. I actually, I'm not gonna lie, I never understood fully how to do this battle, so it may take me a couple tries. Oops. I almost skipped it. I keep forgetting you push any button and... If only I had put you on in your place from the very beginning. Show a human a little mercy and the next thing you know, he thinks himself your equal. <laughs> Given my station... I had to maintain some semblance of dignity, so I'll let you run with your life. Twice even! Such a guilty pleasure. But instead of scurrying away like any creature with a basic instinct to survive, you just kept coming back. Again, and again, and again! I've let a mere boy make a fool of me for the last time. You stand before a demon. What did I say? A weapon without mercy. That second word is technically more accurate. <laughs> for you, boy, I've prepared a more most appropriate and humiliating death. I even have a pet name for it. I call it the Endless Plunge. First, I will take my time. I don't need to hear how you explain. You want to kill me, just do it. And when I grow bored of it, I will drive you to the edge and deliver a last strike to send you falling to your doom. Good luck. I'll delight in casting your body into this pit and snuffing out the flame of your life. Your broken body will serve as fine sustenance for the Demon King. Alright. So that's technically we. I think that's what you're supposed to do there, actually. Dude! No! Link! Link! Thank you. <laughs> Link is such an idiot. Ow. I mean, now that I think about it, I don't know why I found this so difficult to do. It's not that hard. Oh, I get with this. I mean, 
dude. I never understood. Then again, strike three already, dude. Come on. See? We're already done. That actually wasn't bad at all. That, I, I was expecting worse. I'm not even gonna lie. I was expecting worse. And actually, I think there is an opening between this and the final boss, but... Oh shoot. Oh shoot. Ow. Dude, you're a butt. That's technically a hit, but um, where's my shield? Dude, you're an A. Link does not like... There we go. Thank you. I don't know if that's doing any... There we go, okay. I get what to do. Yeah, okay. Where'd you go? Ow. Yeah, he's not that bad, actually. Especially... Especially when you know what to do. He's actually pretty easy once you know what to do. Ow! Bruh. <laughs> Link, pull up your damn shield. That's it! That's it! Basically that. Uh, since when are you Cloud Strife? Huh? Oh, I get what you're supposed to do. That's it. That's it. Why did I struggle with that the first time I did it? Dude. The first time I played this, played against this guy, he made me rage. But that was easy. This, this is preposterous. Driven to my knees by a simple child of man? Laughable. Is it? You, you actually, yes, it is. From my end, at least. Ha, 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 ha. Boy, what are you? Uh oh. <laughs> but never mind that. Victory is still mine to save her. While we fought, the ritual I started continued. Shoot. I figured as much, but shoot. At last, it's complete. The Demon King shall devour the soul of the goddess and resurrect in his full glory. That's 
not good. <laughs> okay. Hi, imprisoned. Hello. It's not good. What? Since when is her soul fire? Uh oh. Uh oh. Don't you see? It's all over. You and your kind have lost. This world and everything in it now belongs to darkness. Since when were you Ansem Seeker of Darkness? They belong to my master. This world belongs to darkness. That line immediately made me think Ansem Seeker of Darkness from Kingdom Hearts. Hi. a cool design for a final boss and for our main antagonist of this story, but dude. Dude, come on. <laughs> Welcome back to us, Master. Ooh, I don't like this. Okay. Yeah. What you're about to see is what Gearhan has been this whole time. Basically, the evil version of B or Phi. Actually, it's technically Phi because it's a Japanese name. Hi! Kicking your butt shouldn't be too bad. <laughs> so, you are the chosen knight of the goddess. Intriguing. The goddess lowered herself to a mortal existence to keep me in prison. How pathetic. This bag of flesh pales in comparison to the magnificence of her previous form. Oh boy. I do not like that. Don't worry, Link. Bruce has got this. I hope so. There's no way I would have made it over there in time. Nice catch, Bruce. Good job. Link, I, I caught her. She's okay. Well, I'm glad. Okay. This guy's going down. But I'm gonna need to fill up on health first. That shouldn't be too much of a problem, though. You'll see why in a sec. Hmm. So you and that other human would stand before obliteration to aid the goddess, would you? No, this is all just for show. How curious. Humans I've known were weak things. Hardly more than insects. Shivering under rocks at a mere glimpse of me. Please. When last I walked this world, they did little more than scream.
scream and cling to their goddess, mewling and praying, counting on her to protect them. How amusing to think those cowards begot someone like you. Dude, I will fight you, and I can kill him. You grow more fascinating by the second human. I never imagined I'd meet one of your kind who wished to stand against me in battle. Very well then, I shall prepare a place for us where we will not be bothered by distractions. If you still have the courage to face me, seek me there. That was your one mistake. That was your one mistake, Demise. Since I'm pretty sure we're gonna figure out that name at some point, or you read the thing. If you can't, the name's covered. Link, it's all on you. Oh, and listen up. Granny has some info for you. The old girl says it'll take time for that grease wad to absorb Zelda's soul completely. If you can take him down before her soul gets all sunked up into that thing, you might still have a chance. Oh, you don't gotta worry about that. I, I, I know you can do it. So, yeah, you've gotta do this. You're all Zelda's got. You've gotta make this happen. Okay. Down with the Demon King. <laughs> I had to say it at some point. Okay, it's creating the portal that we have time to enter whenever we please. If you fear for your life, do not follow me. You can spend what little time your world has left cowering and crying as bad as befits your kind. If you truly desire to raise your blade against the world, I would build, I would build, come for me. I've waited eons to I can spare a few more moments to let you decide. That was a big mistake. <laughs> that was a very big mistake on your end. There is a chance that I may fail, but who knows. It's up to you now, Link. So the idea to beat him, you'll find out when I fight him this anyway, but just to be safe, that way if I do die, I have not done this at all yet. See, I haven't done it yet at all. Okay, the bottom one is going to be the one that I will use if I need to re retry this. You guys won't see me, you'll see me die, but you won't see, like, the retries, and you'll see me pick up from the same spot if I do have to. Master Link, I have important information for you. Once you enter the portal, there's no going back. I know. Yes, I'm ready. Understood, Master Link. Know that even in the place like that lies beyond this portal, I will be with you. And Master... Hmm? That you're not even gonna what was she gonna say I like the scenery in this final boss area too by the way hello demise ah so you've decided to meet your end in battle after all <laughs> it pleases me greatly to see such misplaced valor Take a moment to appreciate your surroundings, for where we stand shall serve as your tomb for eternity. Where the hell are we, anyway? Down with the demon king! The hate for the gods that has boiled in my veins. You will taste all of it in the bite of my blade. So your blade is made of your hate. What's my blade made of? The love of the goddess, I'm assuming? The only
only question left is how long you will manage to remain standing before I take your life. Try to keep it interesting for me, would you? If I remember correctly, I just have to use a certain attack on you multiple times and that's it. And when you do fall, you know that your world and everything in it is mine to dominate, mine to subjugate, mine to rule. And we'll see about that. When I finish with you, you can take solace in knowing your friends and kin will soon follow as I wipe all who oppose me from the face of this world. As I said, we'll see about that, as well as the phrase, Down with the Demon King! It won't be long now, at long last. The almighty power I've sought for millennia. The Triforce? I will take the Triforce for my own. No, you won't. The world shall be under my foot. Dude, you're gonna fail. Ow. Oh, right, just keep spamming. Ow! I mean, I got two hits on him. Honestly, the idea in my mind is I don't think this guy's doable on a three, six heart run, and this three isn't really a thing in this game. I feel like Nintendo knew people were going to try to do it. Six heart run is probably doable, but it's risky. Got him twice. For me, it's probably not doable until I figure out how to avoid his strikes. This part is why the five bottles are detrimental. Like that. Ugh. It's just timing that has to be done. Dude, Link, you're really bad at this. Okay, double, double whammies. Double whammies, double whammies. Dude, Link, you suck at this. Actually, that wasn't bad. So this is definitely doable on a six heart run, just <laughs> Like that. That's exactly how it's doable. Okay. This part's the part that I'm like, that part's definitely doable, but what about this part? I'm not gonna lie, I forgot you could do that. Oh. I forgot about that. Aww. I feel s the last one. Now I feel stupid about the last one. That's why I'm not. You ass hat. Okay, you know what? That one's my fault. Oh, yeah, don't... Ow! The first time, never... Ever... Damn idiot.
done. That, I feel so stupid. So the fairies are more useful in this battle depending on how kind they are about RNG. Firstly, but secondly, I sit down. Dude, down. There you go. You're getting there. <laughs> there we go. Now we're getting there. Extraordinary. You stand as a paragon of your kind, human. You fight like no man or demon I have ever known. So this is not the end. My hate never perishes. It is born anew in a cycle with no end. I will rise again. There must be some way to stop that cycle, though. Those like you, those who share the blood of the goddess and the spirit of the hero, they are eternally bound to this curse. An incarnation of my hatred shall ever follow your kind, dooming them to wander a blood-soaked sea darkness for all time. Bye. As I said, down with the Demon King. I still think this place is gorgeous, though. Okay. You know what? My original statement of I don't think this is doable on a six heart run. I stand corrected. I have confirmed the eradication of the Demon King. His residual consciousness has been absorbed into the Master Sword and is now sealed away. Great. Cool. Hi, Impa. What up? You have done well, Link. Also, question. How did Groos get over here? Did he send through the portal as well? Hi, Groos. Again. Link. Thank you. I think it's over. Finally, it's over. <laughs> nice going, you two. You guys were totally amazing in this little adventure. Oh, you're great. I'm not even giving that next statement the light of day. At least not for my voice. It's a little joke. Joke or not, your contributions to our effort were heroic. You have my thanks. Oh, all well, you know. Just glad I can make myself useful. I'm happy things turned out okay. Hey, so, uh, things look pretty sewn up here. What do you say, guys? Ready to head back to our own time? Yeah, okay, he did jump through the portal. Granny was really worried about you two. You don't want to keep the old girl in suspense too long. <laughs> See? What are you doing? Uh, hi. Hi. Hi, Leah. Your Grace. Or perhaps you prefer Zelda. It pleases me to know you are safe. Master, I must speak with you. What? I see where this is going. Master Link, you have successfully protected the goddess reborn and defeated Demise, fulfilling your role as the hero of legend. My purpose here is complete. Therefore, I ask you to dissolve our arrangement as master and servant. Wait, we had an arrangement about this? 
I don't know, that was just rare, really bad wording. Drive the sword into the pedestal before you, and I will return to the sword to enter a sleep without end. <laughs> oh, it won't be without end, trust me. You'll see him again. Multiple times. Master, you have achieved the purpose you were chosen to fulfill. Please, set the sword in the pedestal and bring the goddess's mission to an end. Now, Master, it is time to conclude our necessary companionship. That's the better wording. Zelda or Hylia, whichever at this point. Alright, time to insert the Master Sword. was to obey the command of the goddess and lead you, the chosen hero of this land, on your quest. When I first awoke and began this task, I perceived it as merely serving my function as a servant to her grace. However, I have come to consider the information corresponding to our time together among the most precious data I have on record. Aww. <laughs> Hi, Fee. I thought you were in the sword, but hi. I do not have the capability to fully understand the human spirit, Link. But now, at the end of my journey with you, as I prepare to sleep within the Master Sword forever, I experience a feeling I am unable to identify. That's a couple of things. Mainly probably love. I lack sufficient data to be sure of my conclusion, but I believe this feeling correlates closest to what your people call happiness. Joy. Our partnership is at an end, and even as we speak, I feel my consciousness fading away. Before I enter the sleep that calls me to the sword, I wish to relay to you words that I recorded many times over the course of our journey. Many have said them to you thus far, but I now wish to say them for myself. Thank you, Master Link. May we meet again in another time. Life. getting messages on my phone again. While this cutscene is going, I'm going to respond. seconds and Zelda's whining. Zelda, your grace, you possess the memories of the goddess. You must understand why that is not possible. I am a being of this age. My place is here. Oh. 
actually, this explains why Impa has been, Impas have been, this, one, this explains why the Sheikah have been serving in the royal family for so long. I, I know that, but... You must return to your own time. I will take care of the gate once you have passed through. I can't do that. You and I have been through so much together. I don't want to leave you alone. Please, Impa, come back with us. Zelda, at the command of the goddess, I passed through the gate of time. I did so to protect you and aid the fight, to prevent the world's destruction. The last remnants of demise are decaying slowly within the sword. Someone must stay behind to watch over this plague. The spirit must not reawaken. You must never be allowed to threaten the world again. This is the net. This is the nature of the task given to my tribe. As a member of the Sheikah, the goddess's chosen guardians, I gladly welcome this duty. Poor Zelda. Poor Hylia. Zelda, I shall watch over the Triforce. Its power is too great to leave in the grasp of man. Dependence on its might. Dependence on its might is an in Invitational invitation to disaster. Holy crap, I can't speak. When it has served its purpose, it must be secret secreted away to lie dormant once again. The knowledge of its existence hidden from mortal history. These are the words that the goddess spoke to me long ago. I remember them well. As do you, I'm sure. Probably. Not despair, Zelda. You and I will surely meet again someday. Cool. Let us go. Okay, admittedly, though, this cutscene is very lengthy. I understand why since it's the end of the game, but still. <laughs> to never exist again. Hey, the Master Sword is still there. Also, hiya! In case that doesn't prove it. Yep, the old woman was Impa the whole time. Actually, the thing that is being messaged to me is kind of important. That's the only reason I'm taking it. See? I told you we'd meet again. Okay, well that wasn't too bad, actually. We had to go five seconds without her. Oh no! Actually, I have to do what is going on. What? Is she dead? Thank you. Thank you for everything. Are we in the Temple of Time right now? What's to be the Temple of Time? Why is the door opening? What was behind said door? 
It is the Temple of Time. Oh my gosh. They must have, like, restructured it or something over time, because depending on the game, it's different. Then again, this is not the background to the Temple of Time. This is the background to the ones like Minish Cap and Four Swords. And even a leak to the past, quite frankly. This is a building that's right outside where the Lost Woods would be. Boom! Oh, and that was The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword HD. Like always, I'm gonna let the credits play and, you know, get my thoughts. Um, once again, I have played this game once before. The reason I played it actually was to prep for this playthrough. Um, when I first addressed the original Skyward Sword, I liked it up until very specific side quests. In this game, it's very easy to cheese said side quests, especially since, unlike the original, you can use a controller like this. Um, in the original, the reason it was so hard is because of the motion controls, in my opinion. It still exists in this game, you would just have to use the controllers attached to the system, which many people who play the game know and think it's better that way, but, personal opinion, I actually like using a generic controller, like literally every other Zelda game ever done. That being said, though, this game still was a joy to play through. Now, what you guys didn't see, I will admit, I did kind of get frustrated a little bit with the, the first attempt of the second half of Demise. Um, I requested the editor to completely cut that out, so that second half you guys did not see. But it only took me two tries to do, so I kind of, I'm kind of upset with myself for that factor. Either way around, it was still a very fun experience. Most of the bosses were cake. The imprisoned and the final boss at first were like the only ones where it was like, uh... even like gearing him wasn't that bad. Uh, Gearing him again is a good example of one of those bosses where the first time I played through all the way through in this game, I had a hard time. This playthrough, as you guys saw earlier, I, I don't know why, it's like I'm stuck on the Elf Here's Curse, where my personal playthrough, if, I, if it's done with a lot of struggle, the LP playthrough, cake. But then there's also the case, if I do perfectly on the normal playthrough, I'm gonna struggle big time with the Let's Play playthrough, which also includes our live streams. Which means at some point I'm gonna have to six heart run this, and oh god. <laughs> that, I don't know, I think it's doable, but tough. It's gonna be tough. Either way around, though, I will say this. There are some downs about this playthrough outside of the difficulty. I still think that the side quests that made me rage quit in the original version because of the motion control still could probably have been polished a little bit in this version. Those said side quests were the, um, the one where you have to fall and land on that checkered spot uh, on one of the islands that where, where the guy was missing his wheel. You had to take it to him. He'd provide with an item. Or a gratitude crystal, a fine piece of it, and then I'll pull this up so I can talk a bit more smoothly without yelling. But outside of that, I think the only other one that I think could have been polished up a bit better, and this is more for Nintendo's benefit, just because I know they don't like glitches. Now, this one was more cheese than a glitch, but I think it was also a glitch because. The one I'm talking about now is the bow and arrow um, mini game, where if you get over 600 points in it, you can get a heart piece. Um, I think, honestly, I feel like, I seriously genuine, genuinely feel like that you could have probably prevented that glitch. It would have made it more dev intended. I'm glad it's still there. I'm very happy it's still there because it makes it so much more bearable so much more humorous to do 
But I guess from a perspective of someone who's trying to review the game rather than just genuinely play through it only, I think that that part could have been done a bit better. However, on the upside of these things, I love how polished it is. I love how now you can play with a genuine controller like every other Zelda game in existence, including games that are incoming like Oracle of Ages and Seasons. Did I say that? I said that in reverse. Oracle of Ages and Seasons, which will be coming very soon. Um, I believe that... And the reason for that is because of, I have a Retron, by the way. I can play it with a an SNES controller. So expect that very soon. Um, but anyway, I digress. I think that in regards to like the gameplay, the mechanics, in this rehash, this remake, well this remaster let's put it that way because everything here in this game is in the original so this is a remaster the the appearance is great you can still tell fractions of it are still like we bound but you can definitely still tell a lot of it was completely redone in a way well either way around these are kind of just my generic thoughts on this still a great experience it was a little bit of a struggle at the end like i said before struggle you guys don't have to see at all but it was still a lot of fun and i'm glad i did it either way around we are reaching the end of this normally i would have shown my whole face to talk about this but since i feel it's very detrimental to showcase um this kind of thing to showcase um, the actual credits, I felt it necessary to stay in the corner here. Unlike the idiot scene when I went up there. I think there's a cutscene after this, actually. After that, I will close off and we will end this series. But there's also your proof you don't need the Hylian shield, which is, by the way, the item you get if you beat 8, not 10. My apologies, I had to look it up, but 8 of the, um, actually, I'm talking about it in a failed playthrough. So, on a failed attempt, I actually tried to get the Hylian Shield, which, the, where, for those who don't know, if you go to that thun the Thunder God, or the, 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 the God that's over in, uh, Lanayru's area, I believe, the, the Yellow Beamed area, the desert, Lanero Desert, yeah. The dragon god is in the uh, Lanero Desert. Lanero Gorge, to be more specific, if you beat eight of the um, bosses in a row without dying, then you actually get the Hylian Shield. However, the reason I stopped at the heart piece is just because, one, it's much more difficult than you think to get the Hylian Shield. It's very easy to get the harpies because you only need to do five of them, I believe. And that are six. Whereas eight of them, that's a different story. Anyway, Zelda's talking. Look around us. As a child, I always dreamed of a world below. I wanted to see the surface with my own eyes and feel the land's warm breeze on my skin. Okay. Oh, I need the controller for this. I thought it was automatically going to do it, actually. I... I, I think I want to live here. I always want to feel solid ground beneath my feet. See the clouds above my head? And watch over the Triforce. Yeah. What about you, Link? Yeah. What will you do now? I mean... I don't see why not. Sure. Yeah. Well, I better tell my girl that I helped a while ago. Yeah, sorry, Zelda. It looks like you and Groose are going to actually... I don't know, the way things turn out psychologically, I think she'll end up with Groose. I legitimately do. As much of an a-hole as Groose was at the beginning of the game, I think she actually might end up with Groose. And that's the end. 
that is the end of the playthrough. Now, since I gave my opinion already, I'm going to leave this video here. Either way, thank you guys so much for joining us on this little nostalgia ride towards The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. In this case, HD, but still it's nostalgia because of the Wii version. If you liked this video, or any part of this series whatsoever, first of all, make sure to push that like button, and so far you can't see it anymore. If you liked it enough and you want to see more Zelda, first of all, make sure to consider subscribing to the channel. This will be the challenge um, that we'll do. I won't do. A, I may do a six heart run, but I'm definitely gonna do this on a live stream, hero mode, because it's much more difficult. <laughs> Anyways, we'll get to that later. But yeah, make sure to consider subscribing to the channel if you want to see more Zelda content, and if you enjoyed this series enough. But if you want to check out any of the other Zelda stuff that has been done on here so far, click the link across my head here and the trainer take you to that destination or if you missed any of the stops on this ride click link in the top right hand corner and the train will take you there where you can check out the rest of the ride if you missed it but in the meantime this trains off to the next hyrule but we hope to catch or the next destination depending on how often you watch this watch stuff on this channel but we hope to catch you guys in another ride Bye.